But over Christmas, we spent Christmas in Berlin, and then we went to this really, really good uh, instrumental store, which is really, really small and ha has all these instruments. Do you remember the name? Uh, uh, die echt gute Musik hmm. Hause okay. Laden. Laden. I don't know. It was really good, and I bought this keyboard there, and, and my husband bought a guitar and then yeah it was really kind of inspiring to go into this little store and then we yeah decided to yeah let's form a band <laughs> the name is uh, really uh, is it isn't about anything but it kind of uh, it stuck to my husband like when he was a teenager it's maybe like uh, I don't know, the legend of, of Skakaman again. Yeah. Kind of like, a, a, just like <laughs> a, a concept that just like, it means the band, really. Rather than being, a, a, you know, a, a word, or a word or of or something anything. else. It's just word for the band, you know, it, and a concept, really. <laughs> We recorded it um, live and in a really short time. So we spent a lot of time in the practice room beforehand and to make the songs and... We gave and us like a dead deadline, like... Yeah. After one month we come to the studio and we're going to record it live on tape and like the old school way. And so... And then we did it. Yeah. And. It was like a really, I don't know, it was really nice. It was it's really different. nice. Yeah, yeah. The second album was more like di uh, digital and it was uh, recorded like uh, in many places. And uh, yeah, and then, yeah, we decided, yeah, le now we want to do it in a shorter time and do it more basic and to, yeah, it's, it's really a lot of feelings in it. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. It's about friendship, really. Yes. <laughs> it's really difficult. Mm. Uh, yeah, sometimes. But it's really nice uh, for us, for the husband and the wife, because we spend a lot of time thinking about this and we want to talk about this a lot. So it's, you know, it's good to have your friend around but then like we're four people in the band so sometimes of course it's mm -hmm. like yes uh, it's like uh, I think they like uh, 
they have like personal issues that they uh, take out like on me <laughs> and the drummer. <laughs> so no, yeah. just kidding. Me and Svar, we live in Seyðisfjörður, which is in the east of Iceland, 12 hours by car from Reykjavík, so, and it's really expensive to travel around. Um, so, but we, yeah, we've been there for like uh, almost a year now, and we, yeah, no, we visit Reykjavík regularly, and then we, yeah, we do practices and, and gigs, and yeah, to, and it, it, it really works, you know, I, I mean, living in Iceland and uh, we, we could not play every weekend, it would be boring, you know, people would get sick of us, so it works really well. It's always the same people, like, yeah. coming to the show, <laughs> so, 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 <laughs> so that's probably the reason that Icelandic bands are always going, like, abroad. Yeah, just to meet new people, see new faces. The accent, <laughs> definitely. Yeah, definitely. <laughs> we don't try to sing with uh, English accent because we, yeah, we we just can't <laughs> do it. So mm. it's really, um, and then it's it's, it's just um, the lyrics are really about like everyday life. Um, so that's of course Icelandic. I mean we're Icelandic, so we just it, yeah, and it's it's also like. Uh, has become like an Icelandic thing that uh, the lineup is pretty open. Yeah. We have like lots of friends, and sometimes they are playing with with us, or, or we with them, or maybe just some some guy who hasn't played with us before just comes up on stage and and does a mandolin solo or or something. Yeah, that's kind thing. of Icelandic. It's just really. It's all about the friendships, you know, when you're... Everybody knows each other, like, yeah. in this, in the music yeah. thing, like... What I appreciate the most is, like, how my friends here and, like, the music scene are... is really energetic, so that, that's, I think, that's really in inspiring, and then, like, this is our normal day life. I, is this, you know, this nature and, you know, we, we, I don't know anything else. <laughs> but so I think like we make music like any other band, like just in the practice space. So it's lot, not like we're like on, on top of s like mountains, like no. making love to the elves no. or something when we're making music. As a, so as it's... A, uh, yeah, as a bit of cliche, maybe. <laughs> it's like a yeah. stereotype. Uh, Icelandic yeah. musician, like yeah, but maybe know. maybe uh, we are really affected, but like we, you know, we we're not like really conscious about it. I think just uh, the people here make a lot of really really good music, which is yeah, which can belong everywhere in the world, but. You know, it's not like, it's nothing like, okay, this is Icelandic music and everything's the same. It's, it's just not like that. It's just good music. Yeah. 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 